How long have you been working as a hairdresser? Mm -hmm. For 10 years. Is that years. the word? You know what? I'll work with anything. Cosmetologist, hairdresser, stylist. Yeah, the they whole all thing. work. For 10 years. I, at, um, well, almost 10. At 45, I decided I needed a career change. And, and I went to cosmetology school. You, oh, you did? Mm -hmm. And for how long? Uh, it took me a year. And why did you pick that? Because I um, felt like corporate America was just sucking the life right out of me. <laughs> so, well, that's... It was a leap of faith, and I just knew that I needed to some, do something that brought me joy, and um, it has. Would you say that you're a social person? Very much so. I guess that's a perfect job it for is. it. Yeah, it is. What have you learned about um, life in 10 years from that job? You know, it's, it's, uh, it's more about taking that leap of faith to leave something secure. Like I had a salary, I had, I, I had a very solid situation, and I, but it wasn't making me happy. And so at later, you know, 45 is kind of late to be changing career paths, but that is the lesson to be learned, that it's never too late and to take that leap and just know that it's all going to fall in place. And it has. It's, it's been a beautiful situation. Well, you already knew a lot of people, I think, before you went into that. That helped a lot, especially opening my own business in a small town. Like, And I don't know, I never doubted myself. And I think that, too, it, it's the universe coming together. When you don't doubt yourself and you know you have this path that you're going to take and it's just going to be good, it's the universe coming together. You can make anything happen if you set your mind to it. At 20, I would have said no, but at almost 50, I'm like, I don't know, it's kind of liberating, isn't it? I never doubted myself for one moment that I wouldn't make this work. It never occurred to me that I would fail. Yeah, so it's Talarico's Hair Design. Yep. Rosanna, my cousin, and I, we started it. Um, we're kind of like the background partners in it, but then Brooke, my daughter, it's, it's pretty much family. And we are all independent. Um, we don't answer to each other. We just use the space together. Do you feel like you did your true north when you got at 45, decided to go this path, do you think? Yes, 100%. You know, I felt like I couldn't go down that path anymore. Like, it, it took me a good five years to come to the point where I was ready to walk through the door. But at, once I got there, there were no other options. Like I had to take that for my own happiness. I had to take that door.